Hi, my name is Tom from the Homecraft Chronicles, and this is Home and Garden for Mere Mortals. If you're tired of the mailman throwing letters in your yard, don't sick the dog on them. Put up a mailbox. It's really pretty easy. I'm using a post hole digger to clear out the hole and what's called a trenching shovel to loosen up the rocks. What's that saying the post office has about the rain? I just hope I get this hole done by dark of night. Okay, a little tip whenever you're digging a hole like this, when you need to know the depth of the hole, just put a shovel across the hole or a board, measure down to the hole, and you line up right across. Or better yet, what I like to do on my post hole digger, I just mark various depths as I'm going. Today, my hole I'm shooting for two feet, and I don't have to stop with the tape measure to see what I'm doing. I just stick the post hole digger in and see where I'm at. Two feet. So I'm just going to put a little gravel in the bottom of the hole to help the drainage around the bottom of the post. Okay, once you have your post in the ground, I just pour a little more gravel. That'll hold it while I'm checking it for plumb. Because you want to make sure your plumb, and that means straight up and down in both directions. So after it's plumb in both directions and square to the street, that's very important also. I just go ahead. Put a little more gravel in the hole. Okay, after you have the gravel around the hole, go ahead and put in some post setting concrete. Just put it in dry in the hole. You want to fill up your concrete till it's about three or four inches from the ground level because we're going to backfill with regular soil. Now, just give it about an hour to dry. Okay, it's been about an hour, and as you can see, the post is pretty well set. <laughs> to make sure I get the mailbox at the right height, I'm going to place a little board that's just a paint stick, and then slide the mailbox over the post. Now I'm just going to secure it with the screws that come with the kit. So that's how I installed my mailbox. A couple things to keep in mind. Postal guidelines say your mailbox height should be 41 to 45 inches from the street and 8 inches back from the road or finished curb. Now using these steps and tips that I've showed you, not only can you install a mailbox, but a fence post or a gate post or anything like that. Just keep in mind that if you're installing a fence or a gate post, that's something that's going to have weight on it, you're going to have to dig your hole deeper. But be sure to check your local guidelines where that's concerned. I hope you enjoyed this project. I'd ask you to subscribe to Home and Garden for Mere Mortals. Let us know what you think. Let us know any more projects you'd like to see, and we'll do our best to help you out. Until I see you next time right here on Home and Garden for Mere Mortals, my name is Tom from the Homecraft Chronicles. Take care.